Hello everyone. This was not a planned video and not a regular tutorial. I made some actions for Game Creator and I wanted to share them with everyone. These actions are made to be able to control some of the behavior of the vegetation engine nature assets with Game Creator. In order to create this we will need Unity, Game Creator, the vegetation engine and my free actions. Before we start I would like to thank all of my Patreon supporters for the amazing support. So I quickly wanted to demonstrate what I did here. So if you import the actions from the Game Creator Hub and a link will be in the description, you will find this in your hierarchy. Go to custom actions and you will have these scripts. Now with Game Creator, the way this works is you add an action and you have them here. And let me just add these. And there we go. So in order for this to work, all you need to do is just drag these objects in. Now, if you've got the vegetation engine installed, you will have this in your hierarchy. It's called the vegetation engine and you will have global motion, seasons, overlay, wetness. And all you really need to do here is just drag this in. So motion into wind seasons into seasons and wetness into wetness i will add the other ones as well in an update but you get the point it will just work exactly the same now these default values are summer dry or just normal and wind is well a bit more than average but yeah and basically you can, this ranges from 0 0.1 to 1 or 0 to 1. This ranges from minus 1 to 1. So minus 1 is dry, 1 is wet. And this ranges from uh, 0, which is winter, spring, summer, autumn, and winter again. So yeah, basically just change the numbers and that's it. So let me demonstrate what it really does. So in my scene here, I created a couple of simple bindings. So from one to zero, one being pretty much entirely still, slightly more wind, a lot more wind. And then we can uh, change wetness as well. So yeah, you can play around with that. And then we have the different seasons as well. Now obviously the color grading of this and how orangey and orange brownie these seasons are that's completely up to you you can just set those yourself this these actions simply switch between those settings you've created or just have by default so really simple but I thought it was pretty cool to be able to control this and what I've done here is if I go to my player go to abilities and I've added these changes in winds to my blast ability the one you can find in my superpower tutorials and the way this works if I walk a bit further and I turn that ability on the terrain changes shading a bit as well so it becomes bluish and that's not the VFX graph that's actually a color overlay from the vegetation engine just to make it a tiny bit more dramatic and well, as you can see it starts storming as well so that's what it really does so yeah thought it was pretty cool to demonstrate this not much of a tutorial as it's just really easy to do just a couple of simple actions and i hope you'll enjoy them if you do please hit like and subscribe and i will see you next time